Hello. What's up, Jay Riders? It's your girl Justine, and I'm back with another video. Good morning, guys. Um, right now I'm at Target. Today is Sunday, and we're about to go into Target because I'm finna look for something for my rash on my neck. My son told me it's starting to look like a rash. So um, I was thinking, like, would Destin, like, what you put on a, on a baby bottle for a rash? Do y'all think that would help my neck? <laughs> that's what I'm thinking anything for a rash because now it's looking like a rash um wh whatever I'm using on my face products the face products I'm using on my face it's irritating my neck like hell and now it's a rash and um I also noticed it's starting to crease damn these people just gonna run over me hey how you doing <laughs> I'm so sorry. That's okay. Fully, I'm so sorry. That's okay. <laughs> um, the rash is starting to spread across, as you can see right here. It's, it was over here, and now it's coming over this way. So I'm gonna see at Target if I can find something. Um, I'm also headed to my daughter's house to cook. So we're gonna be cooking over there. Um, she want me to get some butter. I just texted her, asked her, did she want to pick up something to drink? But yep, we headed for Target. Lord, please don't let me go by the clearance section where the clothes are to see what's on sale. Cause I want to so bad. But I don't wanna buy anything. I'm trying to go in there for specific items. Okay, I'm trying to go for specific items because if I don't get specific items, I would spend more money than what I'm supposed to. So. Let's go. Sorry for shaking. So, I want to look for something. I'm thinking if I look for something that a baby put on a baby bottom. Let me see, I think this might be my daughter. It's her. Oh, look at it. You can really see it now. What everybody has said is a hickey. <laughs> I'm at Target. Do you want me to get something to drink? Yeah. Look at that. What is that? Girl, my neck broke out. <laughs> it look ugly, don't it? Girl, like a rage. You think if I buy some Destin that you put on baby bottom, you think that will help? What happened? The, the, the chemicals I'll be putting on my face and stuff, I, every time I go like this, laying down, it, it broke out my neck. See? Look at Kai. It happened when Kai was over. He just didn't notice. Okay, I'm gonna grab the stuff real quick. I'll be there. You want soda, Kai? You want soda? Juice. What kind of juice? The Mini Maid. Okay. Okay. Bye. She's like, oh girl. Oh, color pop vibes. Y'all, I don't need to be buying nothing. Why am I always looking for something to buy? Somebody said use a vino. I'm gonna go over there to the section. But let me get the grass. I gotta get the groceries first. And then we're gonna come back and look at the thing. <laughs> we're gonna come back and look at the ointments, okay? I don't know if I need some aloe vera. Um, I don't know if I need this. If they have like a small, I'm gonna get a small thing to hand sanitizer. If they have like a small aloe gel over here in the travel size, then I will get it. Y'all can hear me? 
some people are saying use some of this ointment. This, but I don't know if I should use. I have to be careful because some stuff was stinging when I put it on my neck. It burns so bad. Damn, I don't see nothing travel size. Somebody said put some of this on here. I don't know, I'm scared. Healing, this is healing ointment. I'm scared. I'm scared, y'all. I ain't gonna lie. It says healing ointment, but I don't know if that's really a good ointment. This is for crack, irritated, dry skin. Uh, I don't think so. So this right here, it's, this right here is the same as E A A and D ointment. So I think I'm gonna get this. And this one is the same as Destin. So I think I'm gonna get that. Um, I'm over here at the baby section. Um, I see this healing ointment. I don't know if I should get that kind. Oh, they got some eczema stuff, but it's, it's a rash, so. Nighttime, it has oatmeal, skin protecting, relieves itchy, irritated, dry skin due to eczema. I'm gonna buy it. <laughs> I'm gonna buy it. Cause I don't know, I'm just buying it. Anything at this point. Let me see if there's some type of protecting. Oh yeah, it comes with it like a seal. So I'm gonna get this one too. Alright guys. Let me get all three and let's check out. I'm sorry. at my daughter house I'm getting ready to cook a meal she had uh, started like a subscription with hello fresh <laughs> you always want to say something she started a uh, subscription with hello fresh because she wanted to start cooking and learning how to cook and so I'm over here to um, make a meal for her so this is the meal that we're gonna make it is called this chicken sausage spaghetti Bologna. <laughs> That's what it look like, bologna. <laughs> uh, but anyways, um, I'm about to make that. I wanted to show y'all. I cut up some. Um, the, I cut up the zucchini that's in there, so I got to season. Where your where your olive oil at? And let me tell y'all. Look at this pretty girl. I made a uh, um. Hi. <laughs> Anyways, I was vlogging. Look, my camera is still sitting up there. Show them. Up there, out where I was. So, right? Let me tell y'all. So, I tried. I called myself trying to make one meal. And messed up. It did not turn out right. I ain't following instructions. Because I'm listening to her instructions instead of what the paper say. I don't know what the paper say. Because I ain't reading. No, she, she like, clean your fruit. Clean the vegetables first. I don't know. It just threw me off. So I made a vlog. I was vlogging cooking. I was like, I'm not uploading because I ain't like it. 
You should have just still uploaded because it could be a fail. No, because I didn't record nothing much. Oh my Once God. I was like, mm -mm, mm -mm. Where's your olive oil? It's back behind it. You know, over here? Yeah, oh yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Then get the salt, they got the salt, pepper. Yep, so, anyways, mm -hmm. I'm over here, uh, you know, trying to make it do what it do. Trying to cook. Uh, I, told, I told her a meal because y'all let me tell y'all I got five meals now and I told her she need to take one home yes yeah, she wants to take she a, get a meal I home. might do I might do one on live that'd be yeah. something to do on live if you want to do that uh whichever one you say you want one for the first time the no I high. said you need to be cooking something from the first time before that stuff go bad that's what I'm saying you can take the mushroom pasta or you want the meat lovers with the asparagus and mashed potatoes, this is gonna be a good one. Oh, um, that's the first one. Yeah, because you don't want your asparagus and mushrooms and stuff go bad. Yeah, that's what I mean. You can take that, and then if we got, I can just come over and get a plate. Mm. And everyone could just put a little tiny season on it. Yeah, this hell on fresh stuff, um, you gotta cook right away. You don't want it to go bad, your stuff go bad. <laughs> my daughter looked at my neck, so I said, is that contagious? Girl, scary butt. But I'll be asking the same kind of questions because I don't know what the hell that is. She don't know what it is. She don't know I broke out. Y'all, y'all at the live, y'all said it was a hickey. <laughs> this is no hickey. This is a straight up rash. This is a straight up, I'm scared. What the hell is that? So, I'm sorry guys. I just, I keep it 100. I share a lot. I said I was gonna stop sharing a lot, but I had to share that. I had to share this. I had to share, I had to share my neck being broke out. That I had to share. So I'm just tossing around the the, the zucchini on the on the pan a little bit so it can be you know seasoned in the oil tossing around in the oil in the seasoning and I'm about to pop that in the oven let's see what the instructions say how long it says it's supposed to be in there for like eight to some minutes but we, you know we like to cook our stuff sometimes a little bit longer but the instruction said um Toss the zucchini in cushion shape, drizzle with oil, seasoning, um, broil until soft in five to seven minutes. It says broil, five to seven minutes. Do we put on broil? I'm just gonna put on bake. It says broil, but I'm put on bake. Cause what's broil? Broil is when you use the bottom of the part, bottom of the stove, right? We don't broil. <laughs> I don't broil. Shut up. Oh shit. Okay, so now I got the. It's like focus over there instead of over here. So now I got the zucchini on, and I made I made me and Kai some some a fruit bowl. I made this, and um, he didn't gave up eating on it. But y'all, it's so hot outside that this fruit bowl is so refreshing. Marisha, you can have some failed dishes because not every, what? not everybody dish is gonna turn out right. Like I've had some failed dishes. That's how you learn. So I got the zucchini on. I'm about to get ready to put the spaghetti on. This spaghetti. You want some juice, Kai? What? I'm gonna put this on next. The boy. My, my look at my grandpappy, y'all. He's packed up, ready to go with me. Look. 
Come here. He put on his book bag. <laughs> he ready to go with me. Oh my God. Oh baby. All right guys, this is it. The meal is done. Me and Marisha meal, so I'm about to get ready to taste it. I don't know what my Risha doing, but let me get ready to taste it. Let me, this gonna be my in first impression of how this meal turned. <laughs> let me see how I did. Mmm. Come on girl, taste it. It really ain't that bad. Mmm. It is good. At least in my opinion, it's good. Um, I never made spaghetti with like zucchini in it. This got chicken, that chicken mixture. Mm hmm This is good. This is really good. Mm -hmm. I'm finally back home and Kai wanted to come with me y'all. <laughs> I can't say no to him. That's my grandbaby. So anyways, look at my rash now. It looks terrible. I'm like, I feel like this thing is not healing at all. And so what I'm going to do right now is wash it really good with some antibacterial soap and I'm going to clean it with my peroxide and then I think I'm apply some um A and D ointment on there and see how that goes okay so let me sit y'all right here so y'all can witness this stuff okay People were making fun, saying it was a hickey. I know y'all probably just being jokeful, but some, some things just ain't funny. I wish it was a hickey. I don't want to be all broke out. I don't want to be broke out. Look at it, it's spreading. So this is antibacterial soap. Remember I told y'all I used Dow antibacterial soap? This antibacterial soap does have lavender in it. So I'm just gonna, I just wash my hands in the kitchen because I wash my hands first time I come in the house. So I'm just gonna rub the area really good. Give it a nice little clean. Oh my God, it's starting to itch. It feels so bumpy and lumpy. I'm just gonna rinse it off. Oh, shirt getting all wet. Okay. Pat dry. This is um peroxide spraying on here now. Just patting it. So don't trip down. This thing is red. It's looking like purple. Okay. I should be letting it get air for sure. Now, let me see what this, it says, a and D ointment helps in prevent diaper rash, seals out wetness. So I think I'm gonna go with this one, the A and D ointment generic one, because at this point, this is a rash. It's broken out, and if anything can heal a diaper rash, it can heal this shit. Cause a diaper rash is painful for a baby. Mmm, it smells just like A&D ointment. Mmm. This 
the thick, the thick, y'all know that thick thing, the thick ointment we used to put on our babies. It's jelly-like. You know, nice. Oh yeah, it don't burn. It don't burn. So I put it on there a nice amount, rubbing it all in. Okay. Let's let it sit. Mm, it smells just like A and D ointment. This one is that Destiny, that white cream. This is the Maximum Strength Diaper Rash Paste. Now, if I have to put this in there, I will. And then I have this um this nighttime balm. This says it's for eczema. I wouldn't say this is eczema, but it's um it has the oatmeal and ceramide. So I guess you would use it for nighttime. This is a nighttime steroid free, fragrance free, paraben free, hypoallergenic. I, I don't know. I'm just going to use, I'm just going to really go back and forth using these things. I'm definitely using this one, the A and D. This is what it looked like, if y'all want to know. Uh, yeah. Let's see how this feels. Oh my God. Look how it looks, y'all. Look how lumpy and, and red, broken out it is. Oh, God. What have I done? If things don't seem to get better soon, y'all, I'm definitely going to have to go to the doctor. I'll be trying to avoid the doctor when I can, but if I can't, I can't. I have to go, you know? Um... But I tried this. The first, This was the first thing I had put on there before. This right here. It burned the shit out of me. It burned so bad. I had to hurry up, do shit with water, and wash it out of my neck. That's how bad it was hurting. But look at it. It looks so lumpy and bumpy and stuff. So, anyways. I'm sure I can go back to this. This got hydrocortisone. Oh, and this is for our rashes due to eczema, paralysis, poison ivy, um, jewelry, cosmetic, soap. Oh, I, I probably going to end up have to go back to this, but guys, it had burned. Look at my nose peeled. It had burned so bad that I had to take it off. So, let me just see what A and D do, and we might have to come back around to this one but it had burned so bad y'all i was damn near tears i ain't gonna lie so i cleaned the area real good so let it do what it do we gotta test things out right so i'm testing things out anyways i got some editing that i need to do so while kai's over uh i'm gonna be playing and editing and then i'll be back i'm supposed to go live tonight so i want to make sure that i make that happen but yeah this is the. This is, oh, you want your chicken? Let me let me, let me tend to him. I'll be back. I just looked in the mirror, y'all, and I'm getting nervous. I'm getting really, really, really nervous. Um, I'm I'm shaking. I, I, I've never seen anything like this. It, it looks really worse in 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 person. Y'all can't even really tell. I'm scared. I'm scared. I don't know what the fuck I did. Ooh, I don't know what I did, y'all. But um, let me see how I look. Um, y'all can't even tell. I don't want it to spread. I'm scared. I feel like my whole face is itching, my body itching. Everything is irritating it. Oh, you could probably see it better right here. Swollen. Mm, mm, mm. I'm scared. I don't know what to do. Right now, I'm getting ready to fold clothes. <laughs> Got a bunch of clothes I need to fold. 
Kai is in the other room on the game. And I'm sitting here like a nervous wreck. I don't know what to do about my about my situation. Mm, I think my phone ringing. I'll be back, guys. I'll be back. I am doing a huge giveaway at 100K. And you don't want to miss out on that giveaway. And I know you want to be a part of it. So, if you're new, don't forget to subscribe, okay? Because a lot of you guys are watching the videos, are not subscribed. And I want you to have the opportunity to win some money, okay? So, let's hurry up, get to 100K so I can get this money away. So, subscribe, okay? Subscribe, 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 okay? I love you guys. I know you guys are going to give me my y'all opinion about my neck and if y'all um can help me help me i did google it and it says something about don't use peroxide or alcohol because it can slow down the healing process my dumb ass i didn't know but anyways um i stopped doing that and then um what else i gotta tell y'all uh, i don't know but um i discontinued using the a and d ointment and it went back to Neosporin because the Neosporin is more like an antibacterial. It helps with inflammation. It's, it has more like medicine in it than the A&D. So I went back to Neosporin. So that's what I'm doing right now. So no peroxide and just nothing but washing the area and put Neosporin. Okay, guys. Anyways, I'm about to end this vlog. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new. I appreciate each and every one of you guys. Thank you for watching. I love y'all and I will see you in the next video.